feels more can be done to encourage people with disabilities to enjoy the sport that he loves. So much so that Chris Peskett, who describes himself as having learning difficulties, has started dedicated sessions for disabled boxers at Waterlooville Boxing Club to make people feel less daunted about entering a gym. Sophia Seth has been to find out more. A session dedicated to teach boxing to those who may otherwise not get the opportunity to have a go. Good off cuts, yeah, shields. I love being here to see all my friends how they're getting on with their fitness. That we all get fit and help people. And you made lots of friends? Yes, you do. Pretend it's Mike Tyson. Show me those punches. The idea to run these classes was Chris Peskitz. He's a local man, himself with learning disabilities following a brain tumour. He learnt boxing a few years ago, but says he feels many clubs don't know how to deal with people with disabilities. I think what other places don't see is they look at the person and just do it by, obviously, appearance, but they don't actually look at, like, inside their real personality and their actual skills because they have a lot of potential in life, people with disabilities. <laughs> Chris approached owner George here at Waterlooville Boxing Club about running a class a week. George thinks that many boxing clubs do worry about having disabled people train at their premises. I don't think they will take the risk, you know. There's no risk, you know. Bring them in, you'll see different class of people and they really, really put it in. And you can tell after the training session, they sweat. And they're, they're laughing, smiling, they had a good session. Like the exercising? Up and down. Pull ups, yeah, yeah, he likes the pull ups. Pull up and punching. Punking by. Punching the bags. Yeah. Due to some of the medical conditions that some of the participants have, it's non contact boxing. The session here runs on Saturday at midday and has done for the last nine months. Chris believes that anyone can take part. Recently, the group supported wheelchair user Mia via a hoist so she could have a go in the boxing ring. I was in the boxing ring for a while, which I got a bit scared of, but I learned that as a new skill. It's made me stronger with my walking, with my arms, and just, I go to the gym, and then it's made me stronger in the gym as well. Not only has the club helped this group learn new skills, some have also found love. Did you meet your boyfriend here? Yeah. And have been for five years. His name's Clayton. And he's a very gentle guy I've been with so far. If he misses me a world, I will clump him. Chris hopes the club will go from strength to strength and wants other boxing clubs to follow his lead. Sophia Seth, BBC South Today, Waterlooville.